Well, good morning. We're looking at a dry start to the week. Your Monday and Tuesday looking pretty much cloud-free and rain-free. If you look at Precision 18 Doppler, not a lot of changes across the Midwest. Very calm and quiet to start the week. Our changes roll in about Wednesday, and then we can expect the arrival of scattered showers and thunderstorms through the end of the week, even into the weekend. So a very wet finish to the week. Now, we've had cooler temperatures, very abnormally cool for July. And this weekend, you sure did feel it if you were out and about. Out, and temperatures aren't doing much different for Monday and Tuesday. Today we're looking at a start of around 54 degrees, only to finish in the upper 70s. Now currently the winds are out of the northwest at about 3 miles an hour, but check out the dew point sitting very close to that temperature and giving us some fog delays. Right now visibility a big issue, down to a quarter mile of visibility across Greater Lafayette. So of course that is an issue this morning. As the sun continues to rise though, we'll see that fog die off through the afternoon and through the really first part of that sunshine. Now clear skies across the Midwest, so that early sunrise is also going to help clear things up and raise temperatures. We're going to see a little bit of heat help us out, but still topping out in the upper 70s. Clear skies, though, very calm, quiet weather. Not a lot of changes on the forecast as far as Precision 18 is concerned. As high pressure continues to control the area, we're looking at sunshine and clear skies. Now the big changes roll in for Wednesday. Watch what happens Tuesday and a Wednesday. A warm front pulls through, bringing in rain showers for Wednesday and even heavier amounts of rain for Thursday and Friday. Also, temperatures will be rising after this warm front passes through. And also, not only the temperatures rise, but humidity back on a rise. Muggy conditions back again through the end of the week. Scattered showers could even linger into the weekend. But right now, our better chances of showers and thunderstorms look to be from Wednesday through Friday. Looking at today's outlook, mainly dry, plenty of sunshine, but much cooler still, a high of 78. Compare that to the average of 86. We're very uh, cool for July. And our average low 63. We're going to settle in with a chilly night tonight, down to 55 degrees again. So this cool air is not going anywhere anytime soon. Now, as far as tomorrow, back up to 81, mostly sunny, and temperatures start to rebound by the uh, next couple of days. Temperatures will be back into the mid and upper 80s. But we're also expecting the next system to bring in those scattered showers and thunderstorms for Wednesday through Friday. We could see some of that lingering rain into the weekend. And overnight lows finally get back into the 60s. So we're going to start feeling more like July. I think some of us have even forgotten we're in the month of July as it's been feeling like fall uh, with temperatures uh, getting the overnight lows down into the lower 50s, upper 40s. And even the afternoon highs topping out in the 70s. And that weather is going to come to an end now as uh, some warmer weather and humidity is on the way back in towards the end of the week.